Hey guys, it's CSPN001 here, welcoming you back to Let's Play Rock Power Beach Fans, part 19. Alright, last time we beat Gollum Sr. in the final boss fight. Now we have to beat Gollum Jr. in four straight racing events. Ah, this is much smoother. Good lord. I think something's actually wrong with my controller, because I had a failed recording of this where literally the slightest touch on the control stick sent him spinning like out of control like crazy and onto the walls and stuff. I couldn't even control Twister. So I think my controller may actually be broken or something, which wouldn't surprise me considering it's about 10 years old. This is much better actually though. This controller is working much better. Ah yes, much more stable. And again, I mean, I should expect it because that controller is 10 years old. I've had it ever since I got the GameCube. Now, there's one gold coin on that uh, thing right there, that, that rail that I just grinded. Grinded ground, whatever you would call that. The past tense of grinding a rail in skateboard terms. It's on there. I collected it in the last run, but I even said not to save, which I think is kind of funny. I even told the game, you know, don't save. And the other one is right in the center of this ramp. I even told it not to save, yet I guess it still saved the gold coins. I don't know. See, that lap was 11 seconds shorter than on my uh, failed recording of this. But, like, I don't know what's wrong with my controller. So, but anyway, back to the game. Uh, what you have to do is beat Gollum Jr. Not get your head hit on something that I didn't even touch. We're wearing a helmet. It shouldn't hurt that badly. Besides, Switzer doesn't have a brain. It's not like it's going to hurt him. Or he doesn't have much of one. And we missed a boost pad. That's great. Uh, yeah, the really, all you have to do to get the gold coins is just find them on the course, and you also get one for completing a race in a short enough amount of time, depending on the track. You're going to have to be using four different vehicles, first up the blades, and then three others. I'm not going to spoil any of them. Hopefully in this video, though, I can get through the first three races. I'll take the other path for fun. I, I think this path might actually be a little bit shorter, I don't know. Yeah, right now, it is pitch dark outside of my house. Like, I cannot see it all in my room aside from the TV light. It's kind of crazy. Like, I'm not in the hurricane. I'm not where the hurricane is. I'm way, I'm a few hundred miles south of it. I mean, I'm down in North Carolina. It's up in, you know, New York and New Jersey and all. But, I mean, we've had terrible wind. And we've had a lot of wind all day. Not really rain, but just wind. So yeah, uh, I really hope any of you that have been stuck in the hurricane are all right. I hope that nobody's gotten hurt. I hope that everyone's okay if you're up there. You know, it's been pretty bad. I mean, I know only like 39 people have been killed so far, which isn't terrible, but it's just the amount of damage and the devastation to everyone that's happened. One of the most devastating hurricanes the U.S. has had in a long time. All right. I don't know which way is faster. I don't really think it matters that much, though. Because we are way ahead this time. Yeah, but something on my other controller was, like, broken. I don't know what, but it was not working right. Oh, well, I'm sure I could find another controller on, like, Amazon or something. All right, I'd say this was a pretty good race run. I'd say that was a pretty good time, yeah. 338, not too bad at all. I will take that. That is a perfectly good run. Race one has been complete. All three gold coins collected. We could potentially end up with 84 coins. Patty, I are think. You boy, or do you want some more? Sometimes I impress even me. Yeah? Well, I was going easy on you until I warm up. Who's up for the challenge? Let's check out. Oh, boy, guys. This is the toughest race of them all. This is probably the toughest race in the entire game, actually. The wave vibe race. I didn't save either. That's not good. Well, I better not fail now. I don't know why the default was set on no. It's usually set on yes. So this is only a two lap race. I think it's one of the longer of these races and it's also, it's definitely the most difficult race in the game. Partially because the, because uh, the way the fortress is laid out. Yeah, it's totally dark here, and I really hope that nobody has been affected by the hurricane. 
we just got some wind and a little bit of rain. I'm not sure what shortcut. I think it's that ramp or something. Of course, you guys know that the white bike has really bad physics. And also, if you hit Eric's white bike, you will come off much worse. It's stuff like that. Because, I mean, if you just, like, don't even run into the wall, you just sort of glitchily slide into it. So this can be actually a really tough race, just because of the controls and stuff. The only good thing about being behind Eric is you can follow him to where you won't worry about making the wrong turn of the gate. Of course, don't hit the mines. Yeah, and don't touch his way bike or else, as I said before, you'll come off horse. It's kind of cool. It has the same paint job as his, uh, as his bumper car did. Oh, I missed the gold coin. Ah, screw it. I've got enough. No, I just went for a gold coin that I knew I shouldn't have, and it is going to end up screwing me over, isn't it? Why can I not get this right today? Oh my god. I know the wave bike controls suck, but come on. I mean, I'm out of it now. I don't even think I've got a chance. I got screwed there, though, for going for that gold coin. I will not go for that coin again. I'm just going to follow the track now. I can't risk screwing up. Okay, he's not that far ahead. I think I just saw some water splash over. Yeah, it's whenever the camera has to turn around like that. It's always glitchy. Oh, man. Went this way this time. Wasn't really expecting that. And the second lap is also shorter, so we gotta, we gotta hurry it up. Okay, he's not that far ahead of us, though, which is good. And I won't make that same gold coin mistake again. I won't even go for it this time, so... That was a nice jump. There we go. Okay, we're making up some good time now. This is actually a pretty cool uh, race course, though. It's laid out in a really sort of cool way. Yeah, that is just not even fair. That's what happens if you hit him. It's just not even fair, though, because sometimes he slams into you, and you have no way of really avoiding that. Just bounces you off like crazy. Okay, he's completing his first lap. I knew I should not have gone for that gold coin. That's going to end up screwing me, isn't it? Because I got it now. We're back at the start-finish line, so I got one more lap to beat him. God, I hope so. I'm actually really worried right now. I'm usually ahead of him, but I, although it's never really by much anyway. Just don't hit it. Or just bounce off the side of the thing. God. Can I suck any worse at this race? And I know it's the hardest race in the game, but come on. Every time I get close to him, something stupid happens. Now that is crap. I'm out. I lost. That is not even fair. I haven't lost this race in a long time, but that was total crap. I mean, you guys saw what happened. I fell off because I collided with him. That usually does not happen. Actually, that has never happened to me before. I have never fallen off because I collided with him. So that really wasn't fair at all. And if I lose because of that, I am going to be pissed. No, you little cheater! If I... Okay. Oh my god. I did it! I still did it. Even when he cheated me right at the end, I still beat him. Oh my god. Woo! That was scary. Okay, we're gonna get through one more race in this video, and then the final race will be the finale video. This one, I would say, is probably the easiest is the skateboard. Score two for us, Junior. 
You ready to give up yet? You were lucky so far. But this time, luck won't play a part. Get on your... Ooh, that was scary. Ugh, I'm actually, I'm a little bit... The adrenaline pumping now, because I almost lost that race because he cheated. And I forgot to save again. It wouldn't let me save, actually. It keeps putting the default option on no, which makes no sense to me whatsoever. Default option is supposed to be on yes. Luckily, this is the easiest race of all. Technically, I shouldn't be able to win because I'm the worst in the group at virtually everything that they do. But who cares, because this is video game logic, and even the squid can be good on a... when a city, town, whatever you want to call it, depends on it. It's going to get... music's kind of cool, too, the disco-type music. Oh, man, that jump is always so freaking close. But you about need rocket power mode going up this hill. Okay, we're going to grind this rail here. That is actually, as you can see there, it's the exact same path that we took for the, uh, for the skate, for the blades race in many places. Kind of cool, actually, how they sort of reused it. Uh, actually, you can call that cool or uncreative, I don't really know what you call it. This race, I think, is longer than the Twister race, though. Even if it is easier. There are two gold coins. So he even says it's a shortcut. Ah, uh, there's one rail here, there's another rail down there. And that is gonna, each rail is gonna lead you to a gold coin. You were class, that's what something like he says. And then actually we use the same start finish line as we do for the blades race. So, relatively uncreative, but also economic use of materials there. Eric, I applaud you on that. Using your materials in a very good way by using the same the same track for multiple sports. Whoa, that was close. I'm not even gonna try that again. Uh, I don't know what just happened there. Oh well, not a big deal. Not a big deal. Got a rail coming up here. In a second. Crap, got a hill. You have to hit the boost pads on this hill or you're sort of screwed. Let's go, squid. Let's go, grind that rail. Whoa, that was weird. Well, at least we got rock power mode, but oh well. Not a big deal. I must have hit it going sideways or something. Oh well, not a, not a big deal at all. Not a big deal. I'm not sure if Gollum Jr. goes for the shortcuts on this track, because I, I think he does on... He, he doesn't ever grind the rails as far as I know. Yeah! Super jump! So we're going to skip this rail this time. And we're going to continue along the track a little ways. And miss the second rail completely. Oh well, we got another lap. It's not a big deal. And besides, if we missed one or two gold coins, once again, it's not a big deal. We've got all the characters unlocked already, so it doesn't matter. Well, I would have preferred to have had it for rocket power mode. Oh, perfect landing. Right on the second boost pad. One lap to go. That's right. Don't forget it. Yeah, not really much to talk about here. It's just another skateboard race. I mean, we've seen this quite a few times in the game. And once again, this one really isn't that challenging of a level against Gollum Jr. He doesn't really seem to try that hard on this one. Really, the only one that is difficult, as long as you've got a functioning controller, is the one with Reggie. The Blades one is a little trickier than this one, I would say, but it's still not all that bad. Hey, look, I missed. I'm sucking at grinding rails today, but... When I look at it, it's not that much of a shortcut, actually. It doesn't really give you that much of an advantage. At all, really. I mean, look at it, it doesn't really give you any of an advantage. It, yeah, you grind and you get rock power mode. As far as I can tell, it's really not that much of a statistical advantage. I don't know. That was not what I intended to do. I did not even mean to grind that. I got confused there for a second.
There we go. Properly done this time. Just grind that rail, take the shortcut, and get back on. I feel like I'm getting a little bit of slow down there. That's almost what it looked like. And we're gonna win very easily. Not a problem. And then we're just gonna try to crash, but I failed at crashing. Well, we completed it, guys. As you're about to see, next time will be the final final race. Score one more for the good guy. Seeing as I hold all the cards around the field, perhaps it's time I stop playing around with you. When I get to that switch up there, you can say goodbye, Ocean Shore. Hope you pack the snorkel. Don't worry, I'll stop. So guys, next time we do the final level of the game for the finale, the final race. See you guys then.